Welcome to the N64 Hall Effect Stick Installation Guide. There are nine screws holding the shell in place. You can start by unscrewing each screw. I prefer doing it clockwise, but you can do it however you see fit. Take care while unscrewing the screws since we do want to reuse them. Now that we have access to the PCB, there are three screws holding in the stick module as well as a cable to the PCB. Remove the Z-button silicone and Z-button PCB. You can now start unscrewing the three screws that hold in the stick module. Be sure to keep the screws in order as we do want to reuse these. Now unplug the old stick module. Be sure to plug in the cable of the new stick module first because it is harder to do after it's already screwed in. You can now start screwing in the new Hall Effect stick module. Replace the Z button PCB as well as the silicone. You can put the back shell back on and make sure it is sealed tightly. Now you can button it up. And congratulations, you just installed the N64 Hall Effect Stick. You can now enjoy comfortable and drift-free gaming. If you haven't already, you can pick up the N64 Hall Effect Stick on Amazon, as well as our website, hyperkinstore.com. Thanks for watching, and happy gaming!